but not right now. Right now, we're going to uh, we're just going to finish off the support car championships here with the Jaguar XJ220. <coughs> What's the black car vibe in here? What you mean, the Lister? So yeah. If the Speed 12 wasn't quite as insane enough, well, here's a car that actually you know was made. The, the fucking XJ220. And it's slew of colors here. Ooh. Red. Teal. What the fuck? Alright, this looks stupid enough to use it. I'm using it. Yes, this game had the Lister. The support cars in this game went from, like, normal to, like, what the fuck is this real quick. It's like, okay, Ford Fiesta. All right. Formula Ford. That's cool. Lister Storm. I mean, that's weird to have a GT car support BTCC, but, you know, whatever. Speed 12. What? I, so, <laughs> what did we learn from that first attempt? Um, this thing uh, handles like garbage. That's what we learned. Oh, <laughs> dick. So now we know that this car uh, cannot fucking turn to save its life. Let's, let's try this again. Oh, someone's hood just went to the stratosphere. Alright. I am taking a cheeky line. Just because that was kind of best case scenario. V10. Let me tell you, back in the olden days. Oh, I'm not making this. When do you fucking break for this turn? Is it like at the start finish line? I'm starting to believe it. Unironically. Just doesn't turn. Just understeers everywhere. Stop. Thirty miles per hour. Let's go. Get off my car. Boy smoking from the lead. Nope. Too fast. Too late on the brakes. I lived, bitch. You lost an engine, and that engine was me. I think the game thinks these are front engine because, uh. I'm pretty sure that blue car took heavy contact in the front, considering his hood went flying into space and is now smoking. I don't think they program mid-engine cars in this game. It's kind of like in NASCAR 05 how every car was a 4-speed. Even the production cars. Every car in this is front-engine. Hairpin, holy shit. One more lap, poo. Alright, now that I know how much of a boat this thing is, I'm starting to get the hang of it. And then once we go to Donington, because I guarantee we're going to be going to Donington and or Knock Hill. Um, yeah, it's not rear-engined. Mid-engined. Rear mid, I guess, but, you know. Not in this game, though. Isn't that just game fuel, Quay? <clears throat> V12 Mountain Dew. <clears throat> Porsches are rear-engined, yes. Alpines are rear-engined. 
I don't know about the new A110, but older Alpines were rear-engined. Oh, well. Go, 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 Jack, go. Alright. Okay, that only took two tries, but there we go. Had to learn the car first, and now, uh, there we go. I win. Fucking smoke boy who finished second. Fucking Kirk. What a lad. What a trooper. Fucking Connor in third. Lil Mass in fourth. Campbell fifth. I just like reading these names. We got Santos in sixth. Fossati in second. Seventh, excuse me. Zanini. Zanini Panini. Bradley and Jones rounding out the field. So that's cool. Points are the same as where they finished in the race. 10 to 1. F1 cars are rear. They're rear mid. They're not rear engine because that would mean the engine's behind the rear axle. You know what's behind the rear axle in an F1 car? The wing. That's it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they didn't put the entire fucking engine in the wing. <clears throat> Anyways, Brands Hatch. I mean, rear mid is basically the normal, like, that's, that's MR. That's usually what we're referring to when we talk about an MR car. Because most, like... Because even, like, front mid cars, we usually, well, I do, anyways, refer to them as FR. If they're rear wheel drive. Oh. Hey, you know how I should be paying attention to the video game I'm playing? I wasn't doing that. Fully rear engine F1 cars kind of is not possible. Excuse me, pardon me, out my way, fuck boys. Yeah, look at the old Porsche GT3s. Up until like. What was it last year when they went? Uh, they moved the engine forward slightly so they could have a diffuser. Oh my god. Okay, sure. Look, Quay, as long as you pretend to know what you're talking about, then clearly. Well, that's what I meant, Kim. The, the RS. Oh, what is happening up here? I don't know, but I just went from 9th to 4th. <laughs> oh, blue boy is around. I'm in... Okay. One of these cars has lost an entire lap, because I'm in 3rd. And we're finishing 3rd. <laughs> Not pulling on me. So Connor won that race. Thomas or Lomas, excuse me, in second. That was um, that was kind of a shit show there. That final lap. Oh man, Fossati was one of those cars that was in front of me, but he was a lap down. I don't know which one it was though. All right, well I'm tied for the lead with Connor now after two races. That's cool. Lomas only two back in sec or er, third, excuse me. A couple more ties further down the grit order. Yeah, everyone's just fucking died. Oh, <coughs> excuse me. Olden Park next. All right. Uh, who wants to bet Donington's going to be the final race? Show of hands. It's absolutely going to be the final race. <coughs> uh, excuse me.
it go I mean I think we, we've already oh pfft. see ya <laughs> well that man's finishing 10th oh well, I've, I've wrecked another oh wait no he recovered Get me fucking way, you fucking cunt. Good. Oh, no. Oh, I've been bullied. It is way too easy to get your our car spun by an AI driver, Jesus. Way too easy. He <laughs> did it for that. Oh, he's blocking. Oh, here we go. They're all stopping. Oh, no. The send. Seems the AI has two different modes in these uh, support races. Either take their normal line, which is slow, or fucking send it, where they actually, like, attempt to go fast. God. Oh, there goes that guy. <coughs> Excuse me. Come on. Eh. Get out of my way. Fuck off. Don't spin me. Shit. Okay, that was my fault. I tried to stick myself stick my car in there. Uh wasn't happening. Take the blame for that one. Run, run, don't run away. They're gonna be the ones trying to run away. G16 supercar. I mean, people have tried. Hasn't gone too well for them, but they've tried. Still win this. Suck my dick, I win. <laughs> Get fucked, Glacier Boys. Yeah. Take that, Lomas and Campbell and everyone else. Suck me, PP. Pee -pee. What a finish. Okay, time for Donington, I know, right? It's either going to be Donington or Knock Hill. Like, it's got to be one of the two wet tracks. Anyways, three-point lead over Lomas and Connor now. So, there's that. I don't, I don't remember which colors their cars are, though. That's a problem. Well, it won't be a problem if I just win. So. After how bad Connor was. Oh, Snetterton. Okay. So, no wet tracks, thank God. Sixty nine, nice. <laughs> okay, well, at least no wet races with the fucking XJ. So here we go, final race, it's Snetterton. <coughs> oh god, Snetterton, I just realized this is not a good track for a... Uh, a car that cannot fucking turn because of that final chicane. Anyone who bet for Donington for the finale, myself included, uh, wrong. Go. Excuse me, pardon me, going to the front. Almost 190 miles per hour. Holy shit. That's fast. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, get out of the grass, idiot. Where's the earth-shattering kaboom? Alright, this is gonna be the sucky part. I almost have to stop the goddamn car to make it around. We do his punishment for getting it wrong. Uh, ten dabs. Go. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh my god, daddy, for the rest of the stream. I mean, how's that different from any other time? Quite. <laughs> Shit, 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 shit. Okay. We're good. Everything's fine. I absolutely cut that hairpin, but I had no choice, because I, uh, I did not get on the brakes soon enough. I notice once you start locking up to lift, like, if you lift off the brakes and then start braking again, it's a little more efficient. Which is good, considering I have no way of actually controlling my brake pressure. Since the analog controls are for steering only in this game. Actually, I wonder if the PS2 controller has analog throttle and brake since the buttons, face buttons on that is uh, on the DualShock 2 is pressure sen are pressure sensitive. Obviously not on the PS3, because, you know, DualShock 3 buttons are not pressure sensitive. <coughs> oh, shit. I do on PS2 games? I mean, I know they do on PS2 games, but I'm saying, I wonder if the DualShock 2 can actually have uh, analog throttle and brake due to the fact that the DualShock 2 has pressure sensitive buttons they are are you sure about that cam I thought they weren't people actually use uh, I've been doing it recently and by recently I mean like in the past few few years I did it for uh, the WRC let's plays when I wasn't using my wheel then I'm stupid. Speaking of stupid, the color on this thing. <laughs> There's some cool replays, though. I love the far away model on these things, because it's just point slanted down. Alright, anyways, we got some good enough for a thumbnail there. High watering. So there we go. I win by only eight seconds over Connor. So they were slightly uh, more or less slow in these last two cars for the uh, supports, but not really. <coughs> they're they're still slow. And here are the final points results. Thirty eight for me again. So gonna have to redo this championship as well for perfect score. Connor in second at thirty four, beating out Lomas. For third by one, or for second by one point. Campbell in fourth. Kirk fifth. And here is the second ours the second half with a couple ties. Oh boy. So there we go. Support championship over. Our final support championship over. Maybe some beautiful thumbnail. Let me tell you, bud. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Alright, so see if there's anything for winning. Oh, nope, okay. Literally nothing. I wonder if there's anything for getting a perfect. The only reason why I want to get a perfect 40 perfect score on this is because I wonder if there's any unlocks. And judging by the fact that I did not unlock anything there, it kind of maybe supports that, so. Yeah. I think I'm gonna. Before we move on to our next thing, I think I'm going to redo these two championships to get a perfect score and see what happens when I get 280 out of 280 points. <laughs> <laughs>